Texas Tech University is one of the best places to work in the country. It brings together scholars of determination, of desire to make sure that their work has a significant outcome in changing ourselves for a much more positive future in society. The Texas Tech Neuroimaging Institute is one example of the multidisciplinary initiatives that we have at Texas Tech. Uh, we have cluster initiatives that are moving our institution forward, keeping us on the cutting edge as we evolve as a national research university. We have the unique opportunity because we have the medical school and the academic school side by side and we have very close collaboration with the faculty. So we can really do uh, cutting edge basic science research as well as application to clinical cases where we can help the patients and healthcare. The three Tesla Siemens uh, SCIDA MRI system has four different modalities. We have uh, functional MRI, then we have DTI. The other modality is the MRI itself. And then we can also do magnetic resonance spectroscopy. Our machine is the only three Tesla machine in surrounding 350 mile radius zone. So this actually uh, enhances the capability of the physicians to detect, not only to detect, but diagnose and also have some prognostic ideas. By taking the advanced imaging we can offer. The extraordinary feature of our brains is its, its precision and diversity of its many, many abilities. A testing modality like a, this magnet, a 3 Tesla MRI, with the different testing modes, it gives us a much larger window into how these different functions take place. And hopefully by understanding how it works, we have a better understanding when it doesn't work so well and giving us tools on how to repair, how to restore, and how to bring it back to function for our patients. The scanner we have when it was bought in 2011, it is a clinical scanner. So in order to have it operated in a research manner by implementation of new pulse sequences and detection algorithms, we had to have a master ag research agreement with Siemens Healthcare. We have developed some novel pulse sequences that was developed in simulation. So now with the master research agreement, we can implement it in the real scanner to make it work faster. A lot of the research that we've been doing uh, here at Texas Tech uh, has to do with how people represent categories. A lot of our work lately is looking at the neural mechanisms that shape these category representations. So can we measure uh, graded structure in the brain, which items are more typical of their category than other items, and using this neural typicality measure, study how category representations are shaped on the basis of learning. The cutting edge research that we do, it can be applied for the benefit of the patients at Health Sciences Center. The multiple sclerosis pictures of MRI, they're T1 weighted. And you look at the structural um, picture of the brain uh, to find out where there are pathology or lesions. We have computational neuroimaging group here that develops algorithms for segmentation and finding even the small lesions easier to detect so that helps the radiologist to find the onset of the multiple sclerosis and also monitor it over time. Here at Texas Tech uh, Neuroscience Imaging, we see a number of joint programs that have developed in places that we really didn't realize would, would, would see them emerge, like in competitive game analysis from, say, our world-class chess program to human sciences and understanding recidivism and addictive behaviors to more conventional understanding of, say, how to improve imaging modalities for um, medical applications. So it's really all across the board. I think so many of the questions we have today are very complex and require expertise in a lot of different areas to really solve. And uh, so I think uh, to get the uh, more precise results that we need to move science forward uh, requires this type of approach. And I think uh, this is an exciting opportunity through this institute to address those questions.